What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. As you know, my name is Candace B. Um, if this is your first time here, welcome. If you are a current subscriber, I appreciate you as well. Welcome back. Um, today we're going to get into some micro loop link hair extensions. Um, just to give you a background of my hair, I was natural for all of four months. I cut all my hair off and I couldn't take it anymore. I permed it. Um, this is like how much it grew since, you know, from cutting it all off. So I'm just going to add some length to my hair because being natural, it made my scalp very, very tender. Like I didn't even know I was tender headed until I became natural. I was never tender headed before that. So um, I did perm it and wash, condition it, flat ironed it. I didn't put no oils in it. So my scalp may be dry. We're going to get into some, um, some micro links. I don't want to do a sew in because my hair is um, very tender. My scalp is very tender right now. So these are the micro links we're going to get into. Um, and I have 20 inches and 18 inches. I'm just going to do these on myself just to give my hair some added length um, because I want to give the wigs a big I want to give the wigs a break, I want to give the cornrows a break, and I just want my hair to just relax and my scalp to breathe and heal. And the good thing about these is you can wash your hair um, as normal with these ends. So, um, you know, I think it'll be better for me to just substitute these for a little while until my scalp gets back to normal. So, without further ado, we're going to just jump right in. I'm just going to let y'all know what I'm going to be using. I do have this um, this tool here. Um, this is what you use to clamp the bead down. This is what you use to clamp the bead down to keep the um, the micro link connected to your hair. And these are the actual beads that we're going to be using today. So they're pre-looped, which is pretty good for me um, because it's going to make it easier. To install them yeah so I got 20 inches and 18 inches and we finna get into the video right now
one pack only. And I got this off. So yeah, this is just one pack of hair. I'm gonna move on to the second pack and start working my way up to the front.
far I have a total of 200 single pieces in my head so we'll see if this last pack does the job finished look um it looks good i think i blended them in very well i think i left out um i think i left out enough leave out so i mean what we're gonna do now is just kind of like blend all of my leave out with the extensions and i'm gonna use my Good old handy dandy fly iron here. Um, so we're just gonna start with the back.
it's basically the next morning. Um, I did flat on my head this morning. Yesterday, my battery died on my camera. So meantime, in between time, I done went school shopping and everything with my kids yesterday. And we got home pretty late. I cooked dinner, so I didn't give an update then. But I just wanted to let y'all know how I laid my hair. Um, I did flat iron the whole thing. Um, I flat ironed my leave out. And my leave out, because my hair is so short, my leave out was kind of like getting away from me. So like all I did was took some, um, some Dove spray and I kind of, after I flat ironed it, I kind of sprayed it on my hair and then put these clips on here. So that's why you see the clips on my hair. So I'm gonna take them off just to see how my hair laid, which I mean, it looks pretty good. It is what it is when it comes to putting these in when you have short hair. Um, like I said, my hair is short and when it grows out more, maybe I'll have more um, flexibility with these. But the reason for me getting these is because I didn't want to sew in, but all in all, I feel like they're gonna do me good. Like they're kind of, they're invisible. You know, you can't see them. Um, I think for the most part, they'll be undetectable when it comes to people trying to detect them. But here's what the back is looking like. And you can see I got them all, all throughout there. So I'll give an update when I wash it or something um i'm gonna do good with my updating y'all because you know i get sidetracked by life and being a mom and i work a full-time job so i will um record an update on these and the different ways that i'm able to style them or whatever but i have approximately um 305 strands in my head and when I went out yesterday to go school shopping um, with the kids I didn't lose a strand well not where that I know of but it doesn't hurt um, when I slept last night it felt fine and normal like my head is is really flat and that's the good thing about um, these and it's, they're, they're very flexible so once I get used to them and everything um, I think it'll be good but for the most part uh, I hope that this video was informative enough as of right now but I'm gonna head off to work um, because I might be running late if I don't so uh, thank you everybody for watching this video um, like share comment and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more um, like hairstyles if you want an update on how I style my hair with these in I'll do that I'll do a follow-up wash day I'll most likely keep these in for like a month or a month and a half I don't know I don't know yet because I changed my hair a lot so um, like I said like share comment subscribe and I hope everyone have a blessed day Thank you for watching.